I've known the Unicleet River probably ever since I was a little boy. I've traveled 40 to 50 miles up that river. I'm a commercial fisherman and a hunter. I hunt and I fish for my food to put on the table. I'm Jerry Ivanoff, born and raised in Unicleet, Alaska. I fear. I fear not for myself, but for the future generation. The lack of ice, the lack of snow has an effect on the animals and the fish that we depend on to live. The Arctic Report Card Workshop here in Nome, Alaska has been an opportunity for indigenous people who are along the Bering Sea coast to share their experiences about the impacts of climate change for our future generations. The Arctic Report Card is an annually produced peer-reviewed report on the state of the Arctic. The annual Arctic Report Card says the pace of sea ice decline and surface ocean warming is unprecedented. U.S. government scientists say there is an unparalleled period of warmth in the Arctic. This year, for the first time, we are including a chapter on the indigenous perspective. Specifically, it will be a chapter focused on the changing Bering Sea. When I was growing up, the Bering Sea would be completely locked up for nine whole months, nine whole solid months. Now we're down to three. We need the ice, and with it diminishing, uh, our walruses are in danger. Even the whales that I depend on are in danger. We have frequent storm surges, flooding, hotter temperatures, not only in the air but in the water. With the water being 10 to 15 degrees warmer in the Norton Sound, I caught so many belly-up fish. In 2019, I've never caught before. My nets actually were totally stinky. The biggest change I see recently is the lack of the seabirds, the migratory birds. It's a whole different, different world that we're gonna have to learn to deal with. So we're all trying to adapt and change our ways of doing things. I'm so appreciative of uh, Noah's Arctic report card to come to us into our country, into my village, into our region, and actually gather information. I feel very positive that our voices are finally being heard. <laughs>